So today out on the field and I intend to answer these two questions which are kind of related right the first up is if I'm flying in manual mode I press the pause button what happens right and then the next question is now that I have my transmitter set up for manual mode which means the throttle stick right is adjust, has been adjusted and it's loose can I still fly normal and sport mode Okay, I'm, I have exactly that set up, so I'm gonna send my drone up in the sky and I'll walk you through it. Alright, let's go. Alright guys, I hope you can hear me through all the noise. Um, there's a construction zone right behind me and they just started work. And also it suddenly became very windy. So I hope you can hear through all of that so anyways um yep flying through in manual mode i have my camera angle set up at uh, 25 degrees uh, comfortable enough for me to fly uh fairly fast and also still have good control uh, of my speed yeah now i'm really trying to fight the wind so anyways let's say you are just flying through and then you you find yourself in a situation that you will need to um, stop the drone for whatever reason so here is where I will press the pause button and okay, have a look I am now uh, I have been kicked into normal mode right so the drone the drone is gonna just hover in place so what do I need to do is actually it's physically um, digitally in normal mode but the switch is still in manual mode so you'll actually need to toggle right to sport mode back to manual mode and then bring the switch back into manual uh, re-engage manual mode okay so now i have taken control back again into manual mode to answer the next question i am uh can i still control normal and sport modes with the stick in manual mode Alright, so called setup for manual mode. Oh, by the way, if you have not seen the episode, um, I'll put it at the right side or the right top side of the screen and you can have a look see. That's how you're gonna go and adjust your sticks to uh, to work for manual mode. Make it easier lah, basically because now it's loose, right? So let's get back to uh, probably I won't press the pause button, I'll just switch it into sport mode. Okay, sport mode. I'm hovering in place, right? Take a look at the sticks. I actually do not see the sticks because I am in uh, FPV, right? But normal and sport mode, okay? Normal mode, same, same. There is actually tolerance in the sticks that you just need to estimate the middle point, right? I'm making slight movements in the, in the altitude control now, but the drone is not changing altitude simply because there's uh, a, a good range of tolerance. Right, so can you still fly in normal as mode? Yes, you can. Just fly normally, right? It's just that now the drone will need some assist assistance from you to hover in place, right? Too low and the drone goes down, too high, the drone will rise. So just estimate a center point, hands off the sticks, and it will just hover in place, right? So Alright, that was just actually a short demonstration that I wanted to help answer to some of you guys of how to, to yeah, uh, what happens if you were to engage uh, in, uh, what happens if you were to pause while you're flying and then I, I'll, and also like how do you control the drone even though the stick is in the throttle stick is loose right all right guys so i'm just gonna leave you with a bit of flying here finish off a bat i'm already at 33 percent so i'm gonna head back soon enough anyways so by the way guys uh, i'm gonna wrap it up right here now it is a tgif do go out go and fly go meet up with your friends family and loved ones Pilots, as always, I'll see you in the sky. Peace. Oh, by the way, the drone handles all right. I, ever since the the recent firmware updates, I don't see uh, much issue 
with making aggressive move uh, movements but I'm not that really aggressive anyways I'm trying to really fly it smooth and control the drone here um, also additional thing is that what was it I wanted to mention to you guys ah anyways guys I'll see you in the skies By the way, yeah, now I remember what I wanted to tell you. I do not have electronic uh, stabilization switched on, right? That's just so that, because this is just a practice run, not really anything cinematic, I want to come back and review my footage and check out whether I'm yeah, flying smooth, am I controlling the sticks well, and all that. Okay, so that's the reason why um, I don't have EIS on. Oh no, battery level low, throttle reduced. It's okay. Coming back, coming back, and then, nice.